And my name is Minivans94, and I would like to welcome you to another random Sunday gameplay. Ah, uh, so well, it's it's Sunday, of course. That's why it's random Sunday gameplay. But um, so basically, I've got a couple topics I wanna wanna talk about here. So um, yes, I know. I haven't been perfect on my uploads. I apologize. It's ah, uh, just been just yeah. been busy. So, but I'm getting back on track here a bit. But first, I want to talk about is um, I guess the news of Call of Duty Infinite Warfare has um a has DLC one. The release date has been announced. Um, well, I don't think yeah, it's been announced like officially by Activision. I think uh, one of the developers announced it, but it will be January 31st, 2017. So we know nothing else other than that, other than release date, January 31st, 2017. That's all we know. Hmm. And of course... Um, I guess we're going to get a small DLC, basically, for Modern Warfare Remastered of, hey what is it, the, I think the game came with six of the multiplayer maps, and then it's going to get the other six here sometime in December, so that's going to get kind of like a DLC, so, so this is, uh, uh, like that would be like DLC point five, zero point five. I don't know. And then you can't keep Frank. Yeah, West DLC one, up. late January, and Xbox and PC will be waiting for it a month later. I, I presume. So we'll we'll see if that stays true of that date, or if it gets pushed back, or maybe even released sooner, but uh, that's all the info for Call of Duty that we have today, and so let's let's move over into Grand Theft Auto. So, is, I was going to actually do my, the recording for this yesterday, Good thing I did not go because um, I forgot what happened yesterday. I think I just forgot to do it. Whatever. But so at the time of me recording this, um, I'm gonna do the commentary uh, on Thursday. So that means I'm doing the commentary now, which, or not now, on Friday. It's just pretty much. So, um, yeah, good thing I did not do it Thursday because Rockstar put out on the news wire um, sometime in September. Not, yeah, that's a long time. Not September, in December is uh, the next update from them will be out of export slash imports vehicles I don't remember what the exact name is but um, and they they haven't put out an actual release date so uh, that's that is um, not not good well I mean it's good but it's it's tough. Just there's no actual release date. I'm assuming if I had to predict when that update would come out, December thirteenth. That is my prediction because at the time of this recording, if it was this upcoming Tuesday, which would be December sixth, that's not much time. And I think they're planning on doing giving out a little a little bit more info so um as of i mean here in two days so 
at the time of this of the video they might release more but at the time of this commentary which is friday all we know is it's sometime in december but again maybe maybe on sunday when this video actually goes live maybe more will be out and they'll be like yeah it's this upcoming tuesday i don't know i just don't know but um What else? What else to talk about, I guess, is, um... So that's... So I guess kind of going through a couple of the images, it's... It looks expensive, we're gonna get... I think some sort of new... Ah... Uh, some sort of new garage... Where that can hold up to 20 vehicles... Or no, not 20, 60. I don't, yeah, 60, I think. I don't know. Whatever. Um, I don't know. It, it looks expensive. It. I have a feeling it's going to be just very expensive. And I wonder, because how it, how I interpreted, interpreted, how I took it after reading it, is um, it kind of sounded like that the garage would be part of the CEO office that you already own, so you just have to pay to get that unlocked, or are they going to be separate garages around the map? I don't know. We will find out when the update's released and or uh, any more news Rockstar wants to give, but again, I am predicting December 13th. I think this upcoming Tuesday, the 6th, is just a, a little too quick from when they actually announce the update. And then, uh, if, if they want to plan on a, a, uh, a holiday 2016 or festive surprise 2016 is... It would either be December 20th, or I would say December 23rd or 22nd. Ah, uh, 22nd. Because that would be the Thursday after the 20th. So, in all honesty, I don't think they would be like, here's this big update on the 20th, and then just a couple days later, festive surprise. If they're planning on it, maybe they are just like, no, we're not going to do uh, the festive surprise update this year, so. Ow! Ow! I mean, so that's why, that's why I'm predicting December 13th. So it still gives them a little bit of time to announce anything else. Let people attempt to make some money. And... That still leaves them plenty of room to do the uh, festive surprise uh, update if they wanted. Either the 20th or still do the 22nd. So that's still just giving over a week for people to enjoy uh, the importing, exporting uh, vehicles update. So uh, we'll see if I'm right. Or we'll see if I'm wrong. But uh, that's about it that's going on for this update. So uh, hopefully you guys did find this video very informative. I'm just kind of going off of what I've heard. I don't know any other knowledge that really you guys don't have. So uh, yeah. I mean, basically that's it. So if you... If you did enjoy the video, uh, leaving a like would be awesome. Um, otherwise, uh, also share the video with others. Plus, uh, subscribe if you're new and you just stumbled upon the channel this video. For more Call of Duty info, gameplay, zombies, and also GTA news. Uh, gameplay and stuff like that. But until my next video, I'll catch you guys next time.